First you have to plot the point of the shape which you need on your axis, which would be the coordinate of minus 8, 8, minus 6, 8, minus 8, 4, and minus 6, 4. Then you have to connect all of the coordinates together. And here you have your shape to do the translation on. Now we have to get our vector so we can translate the shape. On a vector it is two brackets with two different numbers on top of each other. On this example we will use 2 at the top and minus 10 at the bottom. The number 2 must be above minus 10. If in these particular brackets the number is positive, and it is the higher number in the bracket, then that means it will be moving to the right. If the number is negative and has a minus sign on the number, and it is the number on the top in the bracket, it will be moving to the left. And if on the bottom of the bracket, the lowest number, is positive, it means the shape will be moving up. If the lower number is negative and has a minus sign before it, that means the shape you are translating will be moving downwards. And in our specific brackets, for our shape, we have a positive number 2 on the top of the bracket. Therefore, our shape will be moving 2 to the right. And because our lower number is a negative 10, it will be moving 10 spaces downwards. Then you plot the coordinates and you do not change the area of the shape. There you have learned how to translate a simple shape using a vector.